Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today's Sunday, I think it's, is it the 23rd or the 24th? Um, bees are active, but I'm moving some echinacea to different locations, the ones I planted from seed. You can see there's some right there. Might leave those there. But when I had the plants, I was just putting them anywhere I could find a spot. Not necessarily where I wanted them to be permanently. So let's move those echinacea. So I already moved a couple. It was like, what, 24, 25, something like that in this, just this area right here. Now's the time to move them. I'm uh, taking as big of uh, soil clumps with them as possible. And uh, it's a good time now because we're getting a lot of rain. We just had a couple of days of rain. A sunny day today, uh, tomorrow, and then Monday night, Tuesday into Wednesday, more rain. And then I think Thursday is supposed to be 73 degrees. I was contemplating going into the beehive today. It is warming up. It's in the 60s. A little slight breeze. Might wait for them to calm down a little bit. But let me move these for now. So what are those, I think those tags, that, uh, the ones that I purchased, anywhere from like $14 and up for a plant. So these are just from seed. These are the purple echinacea. Here's some breaking. I wonder if these have a really deep tap root or something that I'm breaking. I don't think so. But they do, yeah, they do have some long roots here that I've been pulling out of the ground. That's what I've been hearing. So hopefully this is enough not to disturb it too much. So you can see I already put two others in there, I'm trying to put them at the same depth that they grew in all last year. I have to remove soil when I put these in because it's displacing a lot of soil. So bringing a bucket over, taking the soil out of the hole and bringing it over here.
Hey, lucky me, look what I found, a bag of pine bark mulch. Didn't realize I had its hiding in plain sight here. I put that around the echinacea that I transplanted. So that looks okay. This should fill in. And, uh, you know, when by the end of the season, these should be all filled in with echinacea, purple echinacea. So this is New England Gardening, transplanting some echinacea that I started from seed last year. Thanks for watching.